Hey Gemini, how are you doing? So we're going to do your external energy, which you need to be worried about, what you need to know. I did take a peek at uh, something here. See what I'm saying? I ain't taking out yet. Ooh, if it comes back out, it'll come back out. All right, Gemini. Let's talk about a boss. Gemini. I don't know any Geminis off the top of my head, but... Gemini, you might just be looking at sales ads this week, trying to find a good deal. Window shopping vibe. I'm gonna see what's going on. And just be aware that your thoughts become actions and things here. Gemini, yeah. Okay. Gemini, what I'm seeing is uh, like, I, I guess you have kids, you know, it's very specific. But I do see a mom and a child here and whatever the kid's asking for, it's like, I don't know. I, it's like, Ma, can I have this? I don't know. And I see that you're distracted with other things. Um, I just want to, you know, make you aware that the kids are watching you, what you're doing. How, you know what I mean? They're watching you. Where you're going, what you buying. Mm-hmm. Why is there a delay? Like, why can't I have this? So it just makes somebody more, like it makes a child more curious. Like, what are you looking at? Like, what are you doing? How are you getting money? Yeah, something like that. Something to that effect. I don't even know how I'm gonna clarify this, but there's a kid wanting to know how you get money. Want to know why they were like what what is the delay what is the hold up on the money so it's like well how's other people getting money you know like how are they doing it you know where are they working at something like that you might be uh looking into something like where someone works at how does this person get money You know, where, what's the hold up? Why am I getting nickel and dime here? You know, it's almost like focusing on the wrong shit, focusing on brand names and shit like that. Very judgmental of others. What they have, it's almost like somebody here ain't shit because they don't have brand names or something like that to that, that degree. I don't know, something like that. Yeah, I see that. What is this? Okay, all right. I see the spine. Somebody here looks shit up all the time. Um, but it's to cut. It, like I said, how do they get money? You know, however this person gets money, they're gonna look up like how are they making it? How are they getting the money? Steals your ideas, copies your work, duplicates, feeds off you, looking up like somebody here is just researching the shit out of you. But a lot of times, this is just trends, you know? It's like, well, what, what's the newest trend? Somebody here is following trends way too much. Way too much on a phone, way too worried about what's happening in social media. Um, way too worried about the trends. But it's also inspiring this person to do something, you know, just because there's a bunch of trend setting energy on this okay trend setting well how am i gonna get money man i don't know and you're just looking up stuff looking up what other people are doing 
or somebody's doing this to you because this is your external energy. How is Gemini doing it? Well, I don't know. Well, let's look it up. Let's see how they doing it. Uh, somebody here, wow, Gemini, somebody here wastes a ton of fucking time on a phone. They're just too preoccupied with what you're doing and how you're making a living. The issue that I'm seeing, Gemini, is that you're busy. You're busy looking up ways to make money. And this could definitely be people around you that are fake. Yeah. Somebody's spending way too much time on someone else's social media. Mm -hmm. Way too much time. Um, also, I have somebody here on social media living a life that is fugazi. As in, this is somebody that is using a lot of filters. And when I say filters, I'm not just meaning like for their overall appearance. But for the background appearance, so this is somebody that's going to change the background and claim that they're in Jamaica living a best life. They're at home. They've just found some type of app that, <laughs> oh, Lord, this person, what a waste of fucking time. It, it, this is somebody that when you look them up, they want you to look them up because they've looked you up. And they're hoping that when you see them, somebody's put a, a massive amount of time and effort into deceiving another person. That's what I'm going to say. And it's like for one person in particular. For one person in particular, I want them to see how unbothered I am. It's a massive amount of wasted time creeping. See what I'm saying? Wasting time, creeping. I mean, this is somebody who is on the phone way too fucking much. Um, man, they want to know what you're doing, what you're driving. They want to know who you're screwing. They looking up your jail court dates and shit. Oh, this person most likely has a mental health hygiene issue. They're trying to be inspired by you. Whatever you're doing, they want to do. I thought this was your kids. Maybe it is. I, I don't know. Lord forbid this is you. I don't know. Gemini, all I'm going to say is someone here is spending a massive amount, amount of time looking up the whereabouts of where someone is. They're looking up what they don't know. So they're going to look up bank statements. They're going to look up what, where this person does and what they, what they do. And then they're looking up apps on how to monitor the actions of someone else. You know, so they don't have to waste so much time on the phone trying to figure someone out. They're going to look up some type of investigating app. Issue, this app is going to guarantee that, um, like, say the app is one of those apps that's going to look up somebody's court cases, um, their addresses, something like that. But then when this person gets around you, they got this fake smile kissing your ass the whole time. Look, monitoring your every fucking move. Monitoring your every move. Oh my God. Gemini. This person spent money in an app. You got, I, it's stalker. I mean, I'm just telling you, you got stalker. Creeping with the stalker. You know, Somebody has put a, a wealth of time into investigating someone else. Um, also, this is someone that could have one of them hidden apps on their phone. They got a hidden app on their phone so that you don't catch the... It's like, here, you can have my phone. Here, you can take a look at it. 
but they got some type of hidden app on their phone that allows them to behave a different way when they're not around you. This person catches this bright idea. It's like, okay, if somebody looks at my phone, they're gonna see the clean phone. You know, I'm gonna have a separate phone for something else, or I'm gonna have some type of app that has what I'm really doing. It's very um, a technical, it's definitely phone related, definitely. Given money. This is something they definitely paid for. They are, this is a message for somebody. Page of Pentacles giving money, looking you up. This person is just getting really creative. Um, I want to be able to look at someone's phone when they're not around, when they're at a distance. So that way when I don't know where they are and they're paying for this subscription. A lot of fake, fake smiles, fake flexing, acts rich, flosses money, acts fancy, shows off, etc. Somebody's spending way, way too much time. It come out in reverse. This is somebody, like I said, that is paying for a wealth of act, wealth of acts. Yes, they are. They're paying for a wealth of apps that makes them appear that they are in Jamaica. It's a wealth of filters. It's a very much look at what I've manifested. It's a very look what I'm doing, look what I'm doing, look what I'm doing. It is a waste of time. But it's to get somebody to keep looking and keep hitting the page, keep hitting, keep hitting the page, keep hitting the page. It's a very obsessive type of energy. It's somebody who can't stop. It's like somebody who can't live without their phone. Fake flexing in reverse. Acts rich, flosses, money, acts fan. This person, they are monitoring the name brands, what the celebrities are doing. And there is this whole unbothered, I don't care what they're doing. I, you do care. So, Somebody cares. I'm not going to say you. Somebody cares a lot of what the other person thinks about them. All these fake smiles and fake friendliness and look what we're doing and we're mature and wanting everybody to see that you're keeping up with the Joneses. There is someone here. This is your external energy that really your external energy. I mean way too concerned and I feel like you have somebody monitoring your phone and I feel like there's hidden apps um this own person has either hidden apps on their phone or um a, a separate phone the ego see what I'm saying the ego's out of fucking control fishing for comments out of fucking control Happiness hater. Yeah, getting off on this shit. Getting off on it. This is somebody who pretends like everything's so good. Everything in my life is so good. Did you see? Like, this is just our normal routine. We just spend money like this on the regular. I mean, do you have a TV show or something? I mean, somebody's hurt ego is just, this is all ego. And going through someone's all they comments on social media. This would be like your friends, your family, people who are close to you. They're not happy for you. Happiness hater, fishing for comments. This is giving backhanded comments. Oh my God, I'm so happy for you. You guys look so happy. Um, ego, I mean, really a hype man. But if you really start fishing for the comments, happiness hater. Here's the thing. You can tell a lot by someone's friends. Right? Because you are the company you keep. Uh, some of you, you're really going to get hurt when you realize that someone here has been a fake and a snake with you. This person is not happy for you at all. 
I don't know if somebody put some type of app on your phone and like they can see what you're really saying. Like you're having some type of private conversation. The way I'm reading this, Gemini, I really strongly believe uh, this reading is very specific. Very specific. I, I absolutely feel like somebody put some type of hidden app that they are paying for. This person got creative. They want to know what you're doing, what you're saying when they're not around. And they can do this far away. Far away. So they could be like in a different state and still see what's going on with your phone. I mean, this is like mirroring a phone. Every search that you do on the phone, every conversation that you have on the phone that is monitored. This person's quite tricky with it. I think that this happened when you were um, not paying attention, for sure. This person The amount of stalking in this reading is unreal. Page of Swords with the creeping. Somebody's wasting an extreme amount of time. Some of this is they could get in trouble for legally. Um, also, this person is fit to get their feelings hurt. When they see what you really saying, they finna get their feelings hurt. Goodness gracious. Um, I do have a complete hater here as well. I don't know what you do for a living if you're on some type of YouTube channel, something like that. This person, they are not happy with the attention that another person gets online. They're not. But they can't stay away from you either. And a part of them duplicates and copies off your work. If you go to Bermuda, they go to Bermuda. Oh, Lord. This person is such a stalker. They could seriously get in trouble for this. Somebody else... Um, Creeping with the call to case of sexual infection. I don't know how they're making money. If it's, this is some type of OnlyFans shit. Somebody's going somewhere. I'm telling you what. This person giving somebody a kiss out the door. Have a good time. Let me tell you. This person um, is playing fool for somebody. Like, oh, well, have a great time, honey. Give me a kiss. The whole time, they are hurt so bad. They ain't happy for you at all. You need to start paying attention to their body language. Like, um, I don't know if you're doing this, Gemini, and, you know, you're creeping on somebody, thinking they don't know what's up. Oh, they know. They know. They know. I was like, yo, what is all this window shopping? <sighs> you might as well say somebody's window shopping, window shopping right through your phone. They going all through that. They going all through it. This is scary. This is this is scary. Somebody, when you were distracted, got a hold of that phone. I am. I don't need to. I know for a fact what they're trying to say. Way too much interest in the social media platforms. Way too much interest in them. Um, they just they want to know everything about you. You need to, um, with that stethoscope, you need to look at your phone and see if there's anything on it that you don't recognize um, when it comes to apps. Because you have some type of spyware on your phone, straight up. Creeping with the stethoscope, you've got spyware on your device. It's very important. Yeah, Queen of Cups with the Two of Swords, they're telling me that you don't know. Your phone has all of a sudden become slower delayed bogged down don't know why it won't hold a charge um you don't know why it's not working properly you know
Yeah, this person. Permit with the King of Wands. Ew. This person watching you privately. Oh my God. In your private moments, this person is watching you. Watching you sleep. This person knows your routines. This is awful. They know when you're awake. They know when you're asleep. Is this fucker Santa Claus? He sees you when you're sleeping. He knows when you're awake. He knows when you've been good or bad. So be good for goodness sake. Yeah. Oh, Lord, no. You better watch out. You better not cry. Oh, my God. That's sick. Look. You better watch out. You better not cry. You better not pout. I'm telling you why. Look. Santa Claus is coming to town. Look. He sees you when you're sleeping. Man, don't tell me I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. I know exactly what this is. And you got the 44. And you got the 44. And you got the 44. Four of swords, four of cups. This is a damn shame. Your spirit guides are coming through. The hermit is esoteric knowledge. They're trying to tell you about what someone's doing to you. There's something that you don't know, Gemini. You don't know. Two of swords. You don't fucking know. Somebody keeps popping up. Like, how do they know where the fuck I am, dude? This person, they got the drop on you. I don't know if they're trying to claim they're spiritual. No, they ain't. They put a fucking spyware on your phone. Four of swords. They know when you're asleep. They know when you're in your feelings. I think... Whew, scared the hell out of me. 